on your feet. Well done, you. Building complete. Corporal? I'm up ahead. Be careful. Commander, we finished researching a new technology. Papyra! I'm ready. They won't stand a chance. Healing! No! Commander, we finished researching a new technology. Damn it! I need healing. What's next? They killed one of our heroes. Commander, we finished researching a new technology. Back on your feet. We need you. I'm... I'm injured. Healing! No! What do you want? We're being attacked! One of our heroes. One of our heroes. I'll do what's required, as you want. Yes. On your feet. Well right. done.
He's ready to fire. What's next? I understand. I wasn't certain until now, but you know how to lead. What now? We need to make a stand here. Like this, the castle won't hold a minute against a full-fledged assault by the Utran forces. And I'm sure those soldiers who fled have already notified Myra. Oh, whoever is controlling her. Good. I'll tell our men to set up some defenses here. Let's hope it'll be a while before they strike back. The more time we have to prepare, the better. What about your strike team? You said you're expecting backup. Yes, Iria is on her way. She should be at the border by now. Good. Then we should use what time you have left to prepare. We... Corporal Tahar. Yes? The enemy armies. They are crossing the Utran border, just as you predicted. How long until they'll be here? I don't know. It looks as if they're still in preparation, but probably not much longer. Damn it. What about my sister? Is she there? Not in the front lines, no. Understood. Dismissed, Private. Sir. Blasted. That's sooner than I expected. What now? We need to be quick. Position our troops, fortify any choke points, secure as much territory as we need for an effective defense. Because as soon as the purity strikes, there'll be no more time for that. You and your strike team have to move quickly. In other words, this is our last chance to make fortifications. And the longer we can hold them back, the more time you'll have to locate the room carriers. Understood. Then we best get started. Yes? That's why I'm here. You're... <laughs> uh, I guess I should be flattered. Well, for start, secondly, and finally... Resources... Nothing to thank me for. Just... find Myra. Whatever's necessary. Did you say something? Time to reveal the full plan, I guess. How are we supposed to get behind their lines? You're gonna meet with an inside man. Hervius. A spy? Yes. He's been sounding out the purity since your escape from Greykeep. One of Sentenza's former men. Before we set out here, I've ordered him to infiltrate the Utran army. He will wait for you near the border wall in the east. How will he recognize me? Is there a... I don't know, code word? I hate to shatter your master spy fantasies. Your face is well known by now, Tahar. He knows whom to expect. How sure are you of his loyalty? After what happened between Sintenza and me, he might be... No. I know Hervius personally, and he's one of the most capable and loyal spies the Royal Army has to offer. Understood. Remind me, what exactly do we do once we find the rune carriers? Kill them. Take the rune, 
and order my sister to stop the attack and join us. Then we take that bloody thing to the Nexus and destroy it to break the spell completely. Maybe you can use a Godstone to get back here once you have Myra. That will be safer. Fair enough. Anything else? Yes. Be quick. Avoid unnecessary combat. Now go, Tower. And good luck. Likewise. The Rocker. I'll be swift. Looks like a tunnel, doesn't it? Yeah, and a pretty well fortified one for that matter. Is it open? No, it's locked. But I doubt it would lead us to the castle anyway. Maybe we can use it later to get across the border. This will be a masterpiece. I'll be swift. Zarek guides me. Yes? All right, here goes nothing. Focus. read my mind. I can't focus. Good move. I'll do what's required. Sure. You got Five. it. Five. Hmm. Understood. I'll be swift. What do we need? Hervius, isn't it? Aye, and you are Taha. Hmm, I don't think you remember me, do you? Should I? <laughs> uh, never mind. So Angar told me about your mission, so here's the situation. If those rune carriers exist, they would probably be in the northwest. Speaking of it, where are the Iskander loyalists now? Dead, mostly. The purity gave them a chance to repent, but most of them wouldn't. It was pretty. I see. And how do we get past that wall? Why did the purity build it to begin with? Pure, but to answer your question. And a second one? That one's a tad trickier. Apparently, there are tunnels smugglers once used to get wares over the Utron border. Hmm. Both ways sound pretty risky to me. The first one, because it might get us... Well observed, Taha. Once you make it past the wall, it should be easier. Just make sure to avoid the patrolling troops. You said that we met before? Aye, but I don't think now's the time to discuss the old days. Any idea where those tunnels could be? None. But if I had to make a guess, I'd look close to the wall itself. All right. Thank you, Hervius. Nothing to thank me for. Just... If this mind control thing is real, you have to put an end to it. Nobody should have that. I couldn't agree more. Hmm. True. What the? Uh, you again? How? I mean, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? Why did you leave the camp? <laughs> you ask me? After you and your friend turned these lands into a bloody... Huh. Makes sense, I guess. That smuggling tunnel near the Utrin Wall. Do you know how to open it? Um, and if I do? Then it would be greatly appreciated if you told us. I get that. But I mean, what do I get in return? 
How much? No, you misunderstood. I don't want your gold. What I want is my things back. Simple as that. I was in the bushes taking a leak when the Utrons showed up in the camp, and I had to make a run for it. And now you want us to get them back for you? That would be great, yes. I can't go out there by myself, not without a weapon. And even then... It's all right. We'll do it. Sir, give us the key or we will take it from you. Uh, but... Do I need to repeat myself? So much for not my enemy, huh? <laughs> Fine. Seems like I don't have much of a choice. Yes, I know about the tunnel. About the one to the northeast, that is. Lots of the other refugees tried their luck there. But from what I've been told, those Utran bastards plucked them right out from the hole on the other side. Not worth it if you ask me. And as far as I know, one of the refugees hid the key near the camp, under a rock, for any other soul who wants to follow. Near the camp, under a rock, isn't very specific. Right below the Godstone. You can't miss it. All right, that'll help. Thank you. Well, it's not like I had much of a choice, did I? Now, if you don't mind, I got things to attend to. Go ahead. Of course. Why did you do this? Because I'm not playing errand boy while our time is running out. Hmm. Yes, that's it. Found the key? Yeah, at least I think so. We'll have to try it out. Let's go find that tunnel. The refugee said it was to the northeast. Interesting. Here we go. I think it's better if one of us scouts the way first. Yana, you go in. Me? Well, fine. If you think it's wise. What happens when I'm through? Will you come after me? No, I think it's better if you look for a godstone nearby. Then the rest of us can use it to teleport ourselves. I understand. Then I'll see you on the other side. Here we go. Hmm. Iana! Everything okay? Good move. Here we go. Iria. I had a feeling you'd say that. Yes? The rocker. Will do. Now would you look at that? I'm ready. Good job. It's always a pleasure. Now let's find Lady Utron in this rune carrier. Got it. As you want. Sure. Understood. Understood. You got it. Of course. As you want. I'm... 
I'm injured. Of course. Understood. Sure. Good. We'll do. Zarek guides me. Five. Hmm. Zarek guides me. Lady Myra? Lady Myra. Ellen's reigns. How do you feel? Are you wounded? How do I feel? Am I wounded? What now? What now? You should order her to stop the assault on the fortress. Mm. All right. Command your men to lay down their weapons and stop the assault on the fortress. The Ushran House is now no longer allied with the Purity, but with Nortander. I command my men to lay down their weapons and stop the assault on the fortress. The Utran House is no longer allied with the Purity, but with Nortander. Huh. She sounds different than when the Purity priests commanded her. Probably her mind needs time to adjust. Still, this is so damn wrong. We need to destroy that rune as fast as possible. All right. Then back to Angar. Once we've made sure he's safe, we'll head back to Mullendir. We've done what we came here for. Here we are. Now destroy that bloody rune. Shouldn't we at least study it first? I mean, we don't know what- Are you deaf? Destroy it! All right, all right. We'll take care of it now. But I need... privacy. Are you trying to trick me, dwarf? I swear, if you- Fine, come then. Come and keep shouting at me all you like. Because that's the best way to ensure I'll make a mistake and have that rune cause your sister's brain to explode. All right. You'll get your privacy. Uh, I'll go find a bed for Myra in the meantime. She needs water and, and food. Follow me to her. All right, here we are. It's I won't do it. What? You heard me. I will not destroy the rune. We don't have time for this. Destroy the rune, Iskrim. I won't. You see, Tahar, there's something I haven't told you. Something I only... Yes. The Shapers. I finally understand their secret. Why they persisted for so long. Why during their reign there was not a... Why... There was peace. The rune. It all makes sense now. The Shapers used these runes to control. To ensure that they enslaved their own people by exerting mind control. Is the enslaved? <laughs> so a murderer put behind bars is a slave too? No, Tahar. They use the runes to protect their empire from its enemies, from outside and from within. Don't you see? This is the reason why there were no wars, no coups, no stupid... And the best thing about it? The control didn't even suffer. They merely had their views readjusted and continued to live on a normal life. Lady Myra doesn't seem normal at all. She acts like some kind of... machine. Yes, because neither we nor the Purity have even come close to comprehending the true power of the rune. We're sodding amateurs. What about the ghosts who protected this place? They seem to have gotten more than a little readjustment. Yes, probably because their crimes required a more severe punishment. Isn't that poetic justice? Rather than killing a wrongdoer, just imagine the potential of this. And you think this is a good thing? Look, Tar, I'm not stupid. I, I know there's a danger in that power, but there's a danger in every power. Blasted, you're a mage. Thousands of people would like to see you born. And just because they're afraid of that power inside you, your magic, just like the rune, it's, it's a tool. Don't you see that? And a tool is neither good nor evil. It's merely a potential. And this, Tar. 
this has the potential to change the world for the better. So what's your plan? Use the rune to create a second Shaper Empire? No, use it for the greater good. For us, for our purpose. For our battle against that lunatic Lacan. Damn it, Tahar. This might be the key that I've been looking for. The key for stability, for peace. I will not destroy it. Iskrim, calm down. There has to be another way. No, there isn't. Iskrim, you've said it yourself. With Myra's current state of mind, she cannot help us win over the other houses. And without them, we'll never recapture Greykeep. Lacan will win. Please, you have to trust me with this. The rune must be destroyed. I... <sighs> Fine. Fine. But I'm doing this for you. You understand me? I will destroy it. But as soon as there's time, I will start my research again. And no, you cannot stop me. Agree with me or not, I know this power can do good. I just know it. It's done. Go see out Lady Myra at the heart. I need time. I don't understand. What do you mean? Cold? I don't know, Angar. I just feel different. Taha, what what happened? Did the dwarf destroy the room? He did. I see. Well, something is off. Myra, she's different. What? Myra? I I don't know. I feel strange. Cold. See? That bloody rune, it did something to her mind. Lady Myra, what do you mean by cold? Dark. Empty. I don't know how to describe it. Forgive me. But you remember who you are, don't you? I am Lady Myra Emmeline Arendir, third-born daughter of House Utran. <sighs> But we destroyed it. That's my point. Her mind. It, it must have suffered permanent damage. <sighs> None of this should have happened. None of it. Myra, you... You should get some rest. Things might be different tomorrow. Yes, brother. As you say. Come. Let us call your companions. There's things that need discussing. All right. Now that my sister is safe and we have the Utran army beside us, we need to discuss our course of action. As I've hinted at already, there are two more problems we need to take care of before we can gather to convince the other royal houses to join forces with us and reconquer Greykeep. Lacane's Iron Ones. And the Leonida forces. Iron Ones? You mean these giant walking armors? Yes. We need to destroy the place where the Purity manufactures them. And we need to eliminate Amaria Leonida, who has allied herself with the Harbinger. House Leonida has the strongest army in Nortander. Wouldn't it be wiser to forge the alliance with Wolfgar and Hallett first and then deal with them? It would, but Leonida is controlling the borders. In other words, until we've taken care of her and the Ironborn, we couldn't move the Wolfgar or Hallett forces, even if they agreed to an alliance. Any idea what these Iron Ones actually are? Golems? No, I doubt it. They have the magical signature of a human. I guess we'll need to find out. Yes, though I'm fairly certain the Harbinger's new magic has to do with it. The Archfire. But if that's the case, how are we supposed to deal with them? Well, according to my scouts, there is a place where they are being created by whatever unholy power is behind them. So we travel to Windwall and burn down that factory? Yes. It's a simple task, but it won't be easy. We can be sure that the purity is doing... Amaria Leonida allied herself with the Harbinger? Why? Because she's probably the most ardent follower of the purity's teaching. She was the first truly influential Nortandian to repent when Lacane's new religion was founded, and also the first to declare her unconditional loyalty after Lacane showed his true face and took over Grefo. Could that also have something to do with what happened during the Mage War? That her sons fell in the last battle against my father? I'm pretty sure it has. 
did you know that she attempted to commit suicide? That was only- So yes, her loyalty to the purity almost certainly has to do with her losses. She also despises- That's not good. How do you plan to neutralize her? We can't just- Well, that's where we got lucky. Amaria Leonida has taken up position in the- In the marshlands? My guess is as good as yours. But I suppose it has to do with your father's laboratory. I doubt like- So, Amaria is leading the army herself? How? Well, word has it that the Harbinger has... How should I say? Granted Amaria a gift as a token of gratitude for magical powers, in other words. Maybe even a part of this archfire energy. Well... Indeed. Fair enough. Then let's start making preparations. Good. I'll be here if you need me. Corporal Tahar? Uh, Corporal Tahar! Private Miller, isn't it? What's the matter? I... I have news. Bad news. Report. Uh, our scouts, uh, they reported something. A dragon has appeared near the canyon. An elder. An elder? You mean... Yes. From the legends. What? But they've been asleep for centuries. Well... Apparently not. Are you sure this isn't a mistake? Quite sure. The Iron Falcons found three Keepers torn apart and scorched in a way that only a dragon could do it. But what's even more alarming is that the Falcons believe that said dragon is heading our way. Why? I don't know, Corp. What are your orders? We need to confer- But how? I'm only a scout, Corporal. By the way I see it, we only have two- If we wait, the dragon might attack Mulandir without us being prepared. If we act, at least we're the ones who decide where the confrontation will happen. Huh. You have a point. What if the scouts are wrong, and the dragon isn't here for us? It is a possibility. Where is the dragon now? Is it... moving? I don't think so. According to the Falcons, it is landed in a small oasis in the scorching desert. A one or two day journey from Aenir's blade. What... What will you do, Corporal? I know this war is already taking up all of your resources, but we cannot just stand by and watch while that creature comes at us, can we? I'll travel to the Oasis and see for myself. I, I understand. Well, I'll do it when we head out. Dismissed, Private. Sir. What do we need? Hmm? I've been wondering. <laughs> Is it so hard? It isn't. How come? Well, I'm afraid you see, for me... So your parent... Let me put it... Sure. Be I get people, especially in youth, often crave for what they don't have. So, from time to time, you see, he has sailed to Calais. But no. As your... No. His ship ran aground when I was 14. You should have given it a try. Well, either way. That's true. It was a chance. Their duty. Yes. What a nice... But isn't... Yes. But... And they have them at an expense. If life taught me anything, then it's that excellence required... Huh. <laughs> but we've wasted enough time. You wanted an answer, and that was it. Is there anything else you wanted to know? I'll be all right. Uh, how are th No, it's all good. They respect me, and they respect you. And as long as there's something on your- What are you- It's about Kate. Yeah, look to Har, the thing with the knife. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have done it. What I'm trying to say is, sorry. So- No to Har, it wasn't. No need to apologize. Mm. Anyway, for what it's worth, I'm glad we didn't- Anything else you need? So you may- You didn't- No, that new- So you can- <laughs> Anyway- So, you'll help- You make- So yeah- That's good news. Don't mention it. <laughs>